Welcome back to the Hockey Shop Source for Sports. We're down here in Goalie Utopia, surrounded by the latest and greatest, and I'm not kidding, it's that time of the year where we're launching new gear. We already showed you the mock pads, mock blocker, mock glove. This line is perfect for us because I like nothing more than to mock cam, except I'm actually in the mock chest protector. So I guess I'm going to I will to be mocking be... you then. Yeah. We probably should have done this the other way around and <laughs> made you play dress up, eh? So other than the fact that I've got this on, got the wrist cinched up, I can tell you that I need a haircut and put the hat back on, no problem. Great, hopefully. Like this thing, I'm trying to think, like it's, it's a little stiffer than a sweatshirt. If you remember when we had like two generations ago on the other line, <laughs> 2X Pro. <laughs> Help me out here. 2X Pro, folks. That thing was like putting on a hoodie. Okay, this there we isn't go. quite hoodie. It's a little bigger and a little stiffer through. But man, the mobility out of the box on this thing, like I feel like, like I actually, as I put it on, I thought somebody's broken it in, but then I sniffed and I knew that you were the only one that had been in it. And I'm like, well, it doesn't smell. So Cam didn't break it in. So like, is this really out of the box? That's <laughs> out of the box. Yes. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm impressed. Amp 2.0, our arm system. Um, again, bit of a new and improved. So tell me what we got here. What's going on? What's changed? Well, yeah, I, 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 I can't even see it because it's on me and we don't have a mirror. But I can feel it. So you just tell everyone what they're Yeah, you're currently let's, wearing... Let's get this out of the way. The new me. mock chest. All right. So improved. I had a little bit of a redesign from the ultrasonic chest, which introduced those amp arms in the first place. So that hinge design um, that you see here. So Bowers refined the design. Up the arm protection a little bit, because that was a little bit of the weak point on the ultrasonic. Um, added a new sternum style plate and much more ventilation out of the back and we'll cover kind of those key features. Oh, maybe that's why it doesn't stink even though you've had it on. No, just make sure that you don't start sweating when you don't know the answer. Keep talking. <laughs> okay, so Bauer, starting with the arms because that's one of the coolest features of the chest, their AMP 2.0 system. So why is it 2.0? Um, upgrading the arm in terms of the overall protection and the flexibility out of it. I mean, Kevin's not lying. He's sitting there flexing around in this arm super easily. The mobility fresh out of the box is fantastic for these guys. Um, overall feel-wise, fit, everything like that, once you dial it in and get it all adjusted up, again, that's one of the you know, supreme features for the chest, that's for sure. Um, <laughs> supreme? Yeah, it's you not so bad, again. right? There King we go. The puns. <laughs> arm out. Arm out. That way, perfect. So they have redesigned their actual arm adjustment feature. Before it was done on a draw sting, they've now taken this from the actual uh, Hyperlite chest itself. Um, simple Velcro design to be able to pull that arm up and get it adjusted up to your overall height and what you need. That's for you at home, Hutch, with the short arms. There you go, you got them. So rebound control foam now into the sternum plate of the chest. Um, this will really help you to absorb any of those Chest shots help to cradle that puck, not have it go bouncing and flying away. Great additional feature for the chest. Bowers added a lot of their aerofoam all the way around. Um, still basing. Aerofoam is? Oh, their Thermocore Zero now is what they're calling it. So what this will do, lightweight, um, HD foam, but it's also very breathable as well. So when Kevin actually stands up and we'll take a look at the back plate of the chest, we can see how that's concaved a little bit more and it has that foam all the way throughout. That will really help with airflow for the chest all the way throughout. Tuck, untuck. How does this, we got a little loop here for tucking. You can, Both. I like how it's flexible. Feels like it's a tucker, but. And now it's really, it is a personal preference sort of situation, so. But, but some chest protectors do one or the other better they than They do others. a little bit better, yes. And it also includes our favorite, the fight strap on the back as well, which we'll show here in just a second. Okay, rest of the front, anything else we got to do? I mean, I feel like this would almost be NHL legal. Maybe it is. I haven't checked to see if this is a... Because, like, the arms are rounded. They're, they're not... I mean, Correct. those forearms are really... They feel nice and protective, but they're a little rounded. They're not squared off. The cheater in me might like a little more squareness, but... I know at my level, it's legal and it's ready to rock and roll. So, I mean, hey, you can customize this chest at any time. So if you feel like you do need a little bit more arm Including protection. Including graphics too, am I? Yeah, stealing my thunder here a little bit. 
Cool. We're just about to get to that. So before we get to that graphics portion, forearm, bicep, all able to be beefed up. Shoulder floaters, able to be beefed up. Um, color at a standard, able to do, but now offered in digiprint design. The so if you're anything floaters. like Kevin and you want to see your hair and what it really looks like without having to look in the mirror, you can take a picture of your face and you can get that imprinted onto the shoulder photos himself. How about that? How neat is that? I'd get your face implanted on it and then I'd just make chest saves all day. It's perfect. You just know that I'm the one protecting you. Had a comeback for that. Can't believe it. All right, let's show them the back. So now that we have Kevin turned around, we can actually see that back plate and that foam design. You can see how it gets all, all that airflow all the way through. I'll keep him cool as he's moving around. You don't want him sweating too, too much here. Um, we also can see the back of the arm design as well. So if we get Kevin to flex both of his arms, check out that amp in terms of that movement. We can see how that system actually moves. You can also see how we get a little bit of that tricep protection, just an extra flap that rolls over the back, just in case when you're going up and making that shrug save or anything on the post, Reverse, you do have yeah, a little bit of that. Yeah, that's good for reverse. And exactly, then. exactly. Um, again, quickly showing off that fight strap, one of my favorites um, for all that scrapping that Kevin does while he's out on the ice. Um, again, overall, great chest protector, great design, um, great overall feel. Running man. If you've got questions, about how to customize it. Some of you may have seen, I think there was a Blue Jays one, really cool with the, with the custom digiprint. And it's basically over this area, over the shoulder floaters primarily. I understand that right? You got questions on how to get your mock Supreme chest protector, how to get it customized, whether it's custom digiprint graphics or just as Cam said, custom features in terms of beefing up the shoulder floaters or the arms or just how to get yours off the rack retail and make sure it's sized correctly, hockeyshop.com or check Cam out with a phone call and ask him questions at 604-589-8299 or 1-800-567-7790. And don't forget, any of the guys that pick up the phone in the gold department, they'll be able to help you out just as well as I could. Some of them better.